Hello and welcome to another campaign battle for Total War Warhammer 2 and once again we're going to be facing off against Malekith he's returned with an even stronger army this time a whole load of Blackguard and Nagarond he's got some Cold One Chariots not too much range which is nice just one unit of Dark Shards some extra cavalry they've got a small garrison here um, with a little more range in it not too bad on the range front no artillery so that's good for us um, we've got Tyrion here uh, with his main army. So it should be a pretty good fight, it's about 50 50. Let's jump in. Okay, so we're going to have enemy reinforcements coming in behind us. That's really not ideal. We had this issue being uh, Warhammer 1. Still a bit of an issue in Warhammer 2. Sometimes reinforcements come in in very strange places. Okay, well, I'm assuming that's going to be the settlement garrison and not Malakiv. So I'm going to have to split a small force off to help deal with that because we really need to focus on Malakiv here. So we're going to get a strong front line of Seaguard. And we'll probably get some of our Seaguard. Yeah, so we've the Swordmasters at the front, a couple of Seaguard units on each flank. And then our archers just behind. So we're going to have to keep an eye on where Malekith goes, he's on a, he was on a flying mount the last time we saw him. So that give us really good strength forward range there, might flick these guys back just a tad. Let's get that dragon out of the way. There we go. Okay now the real problem is because I would have put my range to fire on these guys, but they're going to be coming through those trees. So we're going to have to keep our dragon. We might put our phoenix back here as well to help deal with those. Maybe even Tyrion himself. Yes. We'll keep our spellcaster at the front ready there. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll try and mop up these reinforcements with these units. Should be able to do it. These are very strong units. Flame Sky Phoenix dropping its bombs, Dragon with its breath, and Tyrion himself who should be able to do a really good job, while the rest of us will be dealing with Malekith himself. So let's take a look, yeah, we've got a few units moving in. Keep our Cav back here to help deal with that as well. Looks like they're going to be shifting some cab over that flank line, so we're going to have to try and get ready to counter that. So keep an eye on that cavalry over there. They're going to try and sneak around behind us. Start firing on it straight away. Let's keep an eye on They're in those trees, so we're not going to be able to see them until they emerge. Okay, we've got to wait until Malekith is in range there, that should do it. Pull down a Vortex on top of him. Let's try and target some of those Blackguard units. Okay, they're coming out the back now. So we're going to try and get some nice hits in here. There we go. A little more coming out of these trees than I expected. And it looks like they're sending this cavalry around to support. So we're going to really focus all of our fire here. Let's get our other cav unit back to help out. Shh. 
should just have timed that just about right there. Getting some arrow fire into the side, which is good. There we go. See our Phoenix go right down the line. We're really tearing them up there, that's great. So we're going to get a couple of these units targeting Malik if himself. And try and boost one of their skills there. Okay, we've got some units coming in the side we need to watch out for. So our dragon, where is our dragon? Okay, it's, it's moved back there a little. Let's put it back. So let's get our cavalry in to hit that flank. Okay, Malekith is down, he's going after our wizard, so we're going to pull her out of there. And we're going to get all of our range targeting Malekith. So let's use some attack orders here. Our, pre, our wizard is playing, but I'm sure she'll come back. So let's get some nice attacks down on these guys. Tyrion should be fine. I want to drop some nice bombardments down here. Okay, they just pop over as prowess. Okay, where's our other cavalry? Let's try and chase off that chariot unit. Let's try and get some range support back on there. Okay, our wizard is coming back. Let's get her back into the fight. Doing a good job on this side. These swordmasters are getting a bit chewed up there. We haven't got much we can send to help them out though. Try and get some range firing from this angle. Swordmaster's doing a good job of holding up against that black guard. They're tough units. We really need to get some support for this centre. We don't want to lose our centre ground here. Let's pull those guys out of there. Try and get our cab into play. It's these reinforcements coming from behind that's really caused us the problem here. Okay, we're going to get some more range support back here. I was hoping our Phoenix and Dragon would have seen these off a little quicker. Okay, what do we have? Regeneration spell. Oh, cr look at that. She, she's really getting hammered there by that Dragon attack, so we're going to have to pull her out of there again. But our front line seems to be holding. Malekith is slowly being ground down. Oh, we've got Chariot coming in, this is going to hurt. Called one Chariot charge. It looks like they just stopped, oh no, they managed to hit the end of our unit there. Sent a few of our guys flying. Let's try and disrupt one of their units back there. Take out some of the rear of their line. Okay, Malik is going for our left flank now, so we need to watch out for that. Let's pull those guys out of there. Okay, our dragon is pulling out. These reinforcements are doing a really good job. 
doesn't really help us. Can I just blow this right back on myself? There we go, and Tyrion's right in the middle of it, he doesn't care. That was a really good hit, it just wiped out most of those units I think. Okay, Malakef is still going. He's getting absolutely hammered by a ranged fire. Okay, our wizard's had enough. Our cavalry units are pretty much completely screwed. Okay, let's get some ranged fire back there to help out. Tyrion's just going to town on everyone, which is great. Let's try and chase that unit off. Where is our Sun Dragon? Hopefully it will come back. Center here. Let's hold in. I'd love to try and take him out again. Let's try and get away our range to take him down. There he goes. Sorry Malakith. No, I'm not really. Let's kill as many of these Dark Elves as we can. That was a pretty tough fight. It was an enjoyable fight though. Where's our wizard? You can come back now. You can come back, you, you don't have to run away. We just won. She obviously didn't get the memo. Be interesting to look at the uh, battle stats there. Hopefully we haven't lost any of these units. Look at that health is really low. 81 kills. That's for our dragon. Flame Spy didn't do so well, 21. 118, 52. We'll have a look at the other screen. Yeah, tough fight. Good fight though. Okay, Tyrion 96, not too bad. 64 for that unit. Only 6 for those guys, they didn't do much. 127. So 78, it's pretty good. They really need to uh, relocate these um, banners where they go because they block the kill count. 98. So yeah, solid job, everyone did a solid job. Manicus army has been pretty much completely wiped out apart from a couple of chariot units. And the garrison hasn't done too hot either there. Okay, I hope you enjoyed this campaign battle. Um, getting ready to enact the fourth ritual. Uh, we're just getting uh, some of our defences in place back home in Ulf 1. And we're also pushing on the Dark Elf capital city. But that will be coming up soon, so I will see you then.